Yes, welcome to the Jamaica Young Police Channel. To our loyal viewers and subscribers at the channel, we are a group of law abiding citizens who believe in the rule of law and respect the rights of every citizen, but not the ones who do not subscribe to such behavior. We do believe in and support preemptive strikes because it saves lives. That is a logical conclusion because preemptive strikes save lives and prevent the further loss of lives. We are all about saving lives on this channel. We at this channel aid criminals, their financiers, their supporters, enablers and the likes with a passion and we do not want them over here. Yes, let us repeat ourselves. We do not want any criminal supporters over here. Please, we do not want your views your subscriptions, your likes, or your comments. Please go elsewhere where the red carpet is waiting for you. Over here, we want you, the criminal supporters, enablers, financiers, and all the likes, to go to prison or madness. Let's me repeat myself. We are the Jamaica Young Police Channel. We do not want the criminal Yes, as you know, as you have known at the Jamaica Young Police Channel, you know that we have, you know, we use thumbnail and LCD, although you're not seeing us in person, but there's a reason why we put the thumbnail there for you. Not only that for you to listen, but for you to watch, because you see some vital information there. And that's the reason why we have been you. that's why we have been using it from the get-go. And it's a form of educating the audience, yes, because... You know, most people, um, you know, if it's not something that is in motion, you know, with camera and you can't, they don't watch, but they would listen. But we have used thumbnails, you know, to educate the audience. And that's what we're all about here at the Jamaica Young Police Channel. So as you can see, it says become a patron of Jamaica Young Police Channel. Jamaica of honest criminals. Yes, Jamaica of honest criminals. And... We can delve into that, um, you know, at the, you know, later on. But um, as of the fourth of July, we will be transitioned from the WhatsApp group to the Patreon website for the members' safety, protection, and confidentiality. And you know, we did it. We did not start the channel to make money. We are all about changing the minds, thought processes, and culture of the Jamaican people who have been deliberately cultured to become criminals, criminal-minded, sympathizers and enablers by the powers that be. Especially our media houses, and most Jamaican people don't know that our media houses and they start by JBC to destroy the same poor people that they claim that they love. They don't love the poor. You understand? Because if it wasn't for strong parenting, I would be one of those um, young men that my mind would have been destroyed by them because of the things that they you know keep showing on the TV station yes yeah, so you know and we at the Jamaica Young Police Channel want to make a difference so that we can ch cause change to our country Jamaica one way or the other or even to other countries too other islands in the Caribbean or anywhere else in the world that's it you know crime is affecting the people and you we know who are responsible for the proliferation of criminality with guns and all of that because it just did not start from one person you understand it has to be one person alone cannot get this monster out of the gate and at one point we were you know the, you know we were um, closing the gate and then you know another political party just come and just open up the gates and that's where we're at now so for the past 34 years and going on, the gate has been open and cannot be closed. So we just want the gate to close. That's what we're working on right here at the Jamaica Young Police Channel. And the destruction of the people's minds. And it's the politicians who filter down to the community. They are the ones we know who and where the main players reside that are responsible for the decadent behavior and criminality and the destruction of the people's minds and it is the politicians who filter down the commu to the communities 
we want to take it back from them and make sure that criminals are shunned, shamed and live in fear of losing their lives and not the law abiding citizens. That's the kind of environment we want. We don't want a criminal to have no attack on a human rights. You, yeah, if I violate people's rights, you don't have no human rights. We understand. You know, we, we're not Europeans. A Europeans kill the most people on earth, so they're not supposed to be telling no other race of people what to do to protect their citizens. You understand? So, you know, criminals and criminal minded people infiltrate the WhatsApp group. That's the Jamaica Young Police WhatsApp group. And we want to ensure our members are safe. So, we have to use a safer platform and do away with the, the, phone, the phone group. Yes, so we have to do away with it. However, we will still use the number for a conversation, you know, one on one conversation with certain people. You understand? And we'll choose, you know, we, you know, after talking to people, we know who, you know, to talk to. And cause some people, you know, some people just called us, you know, for talks here. But we still talk to them, we entertain them, you understand? And we have a conversation with them. But, you know, when we say talk, you know, some people do not want to be, they don't want to hear their voice out there. So they will talk to us and that's fine. We, we, have, we, we at the Jamaica Young Police Channel have no problem. So we are concerned about the safety of our membership and want to use a safer platform for your WhatsApp group. Only share the group's phone number with trusted members. So, you know, it's right there, you know. So that's what we have done, you know. And to report any suspicious activity to the platform administrators, as time goes by with the Patreon, we know who to add as, you know, platform um, administrators. We know them. We know the people them who we can trust, although we have never met them, but you understand? So by taking steps, we you know you we you can help to ensure your member's safety is protected. So here are some reasons why you should join Patreon for the channel. You know when you become a Patreon, you directly support the creator of the content you enjoy. This helps us to continue the the content that you guys love. And involved in the process, so you, you know you get to communicate with us um, because eventually you you know you guys are the one who will set the date and we come to a consensus which day that we will meet as a you know as a people. You know you're still gonna communicate with each other inside of the group, but you know with yours truly you know addressing everyone and your grows and what you would like us to you know to be doing in the coming weeks. You understand? So it's a community thing. It's not just one person or others who are behind the channel. You understand? It's supposed to be a com it's a community effort. You understand? So that's what we want. You know, and you know with that um, with the Patreon, you know, you have early access to content, exclusive content, and there are some things that that will be on the channel that will not be on YouTube. So you have to be a Patreon supporter to see because some things you cannot put on YouTube else they link you, you know, boom, and you don't want that. And when you are Patreons, you know, it's in a great way to connect with other fans of the same, you know, of the same, same mind, th mindset. You know, we over here, we do not like criminals. We do believe that criminals must live in fear of losing their lives and not the law abiding citizens. And we do believe in preemptive strikes. You understand? So that's, that's so we do it over here at the Jamaica Young Police Channel. You understand? So let me tell you this. When others talking about you, when we say you, you know, we're talking about you, the members of the Jamaica Young Police Channel, because of your age for criminals and stuff like that. You don't worry about them. The only reason why, you know, uh, people be the same people who are talking negative things about you. One time they used to say positive things about you. But that's how it is. But when it comes when others start negatively about you, it can be one either of two things. They are jealous of you. They may see you as a threat to their success or happiness and try to tear you down to make themselves feel better. They are trying to protect themselves. They may have had negative experience with you in the past and they may be trying to warn others about you. Trying to understand why others negatively talk about you is essential. If they are jealous of you, you may need to get some boundaries to protect yourself. 
So that's the reason why we are getting this is the boundary you now to protect us at the Jamaica Young Police Channel. Yes, so we're not leaving ourselves unprotected. So if they are trying to defend themselves, they may need to apologize for you know for their past behaviors and make amends. But you know they haven't done that as yet. Especially you know the liars, the man, the propaganda is and we have as we have said and we said before, we not, we we're gonna follow these people to the gate of L's the gate of L. If there's more than one L we follow them to the to them to the L's to get justice because they have to pay for what they have done, all of them. Um we in ugly some foot to hype um Mr Mr M uh, man from Georgia and the person that using the New York number. We're not gonna repeat them name up here, but we won't stop. We'll follow them to the gates of L. Trust me on that. Jamaica Young Police Channel members, you understand? So you know, so remember that everyone has their perspective, and what one person see as unfavorable, unfavorability, another person may see it as positive. And you know, we're just gonna give you some little tips how to deal with people with negative comments. Don't take it personally. It is easy to take negative comments personally, but it is essential to remember that they are often not about you, they are about the other person's insecurities or fears. And let me repeat it because I love to repeat things because I love when, you know, the audience and because each one teach one. It is easy to take negative comments personally, but it is essential to remember that they are often not about you, they are about the other person's insecurities or fears. So when people say things about you, bad things about you, don't take it personal. They're saying it because they, they are insecure and them fear, they might fear, them fear you, that's why they do that. So you understand. So if you're trying to understand why someone is saying negatives about, negative things about you, ask them for clarification. This will help you to understand their perspective and to respond helpfully. It's when you ask them for clarification and they cannot clar uh, clarify what they are saying, you know that they are lying. You understand? Because they cannot clarify what they are saying. They're just throwing it out there and it's thick on the wall, it's thick. And then the worst thing when you you ask them the question, you understand? And then them delete your question. They don't answer you. But them still are continue them rant. You know that they are liars, propagandists, and you know me, their main thing is to destroy um, people's character and credibility and integrity. So that's why it's good for you to set down these boundaries. You understand? So it's you know if somebody continue, if someone constantly comments negatively about you, it is essential to set boundaries. This means telling them that you do not appreciate their comment and would like them to stop. Or you know when somebody um saying things that are not truth about you, it's not truth. What they're saying is not truth truthfulness. It's just lie they lying about you. You remind them. You send them a notice and let them know that whatever you're saying, you're trying to impose my character, credibility and integrity and if you continue I will sue you for defamation of character. That's the reason why we have said before that's you know that is one of the main reasons why we are transition to Patreon because you know we want to make sure that all these people who are out there doing things that we are able to have access, easy access and things so we know who we are talking to. You understand? Talk to a trusted friend and family member if you feel hurt or upset by negative comments. They can offer support and help you deal with it. Remember that you are not alone. Everyone experiences negative comments at some point in their lives. The important thing is to keep them from getting to you. Focus on positive things in your life and please ask others for support. So we at the Jamaica Young Police Channel, as we said, by the 4th of July, we'll be transitioned from the WhatsApp group onto Patreon. And as you can see, it's patreon.com forward slash Jamaica Young Police. Yes. So we have two members already. Welcome. And there's no reason we're not going to use, um, you know, even the YouTube membership. If, you know, that will be going away shortly too. So please consider joining Patreon. 